Hello everyone, this is Juan from GenHub and welcome to another anatomy tutorial where this time we're going to be looking at the heart valves. And in order to do so, we're going to be exploring mainly this image that you see now on the screen. And to show you what is happening here, I have another image of the heart here. So this is an interior view of the heart. And on this image on the right side, what we did is just made a cut here where we can then expose the different valves of the heart from a superior view. So we're looking at it from a superior view. And this portion here is the anterior part or the front of the heart, while this part here is the posterior or the back portion of the heart. So we're basically looking at this here as we're looking at the top portion. If we made a cut and looking now from the superior view or cranial view. The first point that I would like to make that you can clearly see here on this image is that there are four main valves in the heart. So two atrioventricular valves, which are known as the mitral valve and the tricuspid valve. You can see here, this is the mitral valve and the tricuspid valve. There are also two semilunar valves that are found in the arteries. These are then the aortic valve and the pulmonary valve. Now notice here that this is the aortic valve in the aorta and the pulmonary valve found on the pulmonary trunk. Now let's explore these structures in a little bit more detail. And right now we're looking at the mitral valve or the left atrioventricular valve highlighted in green. We just made here a cut on the left ventricle of the heart and we can then expose here the left atrioventricular valve or the mitral valve. You can also call this valve as the bicuspid valve because as the name indicates bi meaning dual flap cuspid cusp so dual flap valve that you find in your heart that lies between the left atrium and the left ventricle and as you can see this is the left ventricle as I mentioned and the left atrium should be around here. In terms of role, uh, the role of the left atrioventricular valve that you see now highlighted in green from this superior view, the role of the mitral valve will be to then during a diastole a normally functioned mitral valve will be opening as a result of increased pressure from the left atrium as it fills with blood. This video is not over yet. Continue watching now the full video at KenHub.com. We have lots more videos like this one available to our premium members on our website, not to mention all the fun quizzes, related articles, and atlas sections. So click on the button in the middle to watch the full-length video and master anatomy.